Express templates speed up your image creation with ready-made photos consisting of layer sets. They let you see exactly how a photo is put together from the inside. Then you can tweak, adjust, and add to any layer to make original compositions. Let's take a look at how to use them. Open Photo Director and select the Layers tab. You will first need to choose a background image to apply the template to. Let's choose the built-in image of the Taiwanese Aboriginal boat. After selecting this, click on the layer icon with the blue plus symbol next to it. Then select Add Express Template. In the dialog box that pops up, you can choose any of the existing templates based on their suitability for your project. Or you can click on the link at the bottom of the box and head over to Director Zone to find more. Let's choose the Ocean Dreaming template. Click on it, then click OK. Photo Director will then apply the template you've selected to the background image you chose originally. In the left panel, you can see all the individual layers that make up the image. There are a couple of text layers, along with several image and adjustment layers. To see the effect that each layer has on the image, you can turn the visibility of the layer on and off by clicking the eye icon. To adjust any particular layer, click on the adjustment icon to the right of the layer. Let's adjust layer 2. Click on the adjustment icon and a new panel will open up showing just the selected layer. We can quickly bring in a warmer feel by moving the temperature slider up to around 65. Click OK. You can now see that the sky and clouds have a subtle pinkish tint to them and some of the coolness has been taken out of the water. You can continue to play around with the various layers to get the effect you want. If you want to remove a layer completely, simply right click on it and select Delete Layer. To alter any of the text layers, click on the text icon along the top of the viewing window. You can then select any text component using the cursor to change what is written, the font, text size, position or color. When you're done, exit out of the text window by hitting the text icon again. Another handy feature is the pick and move tool. If you want to change the dimensions or position of a layer image, this is the tool to use. Let's take layer 13 as an example. This layer is the pink inner rectangle in the image. If we wanted to change the size of that rectangle, perhaps making it smaller and more centered, first select the layer, then click on the pick and move tool. A transformation box will appear around the image and you can click, drag, or rotate any of the points to readjust until you're happy with it. When you're finished with your change, save the photo by clicking export below the viewing window. Then choose your destination folder for your work. You can also choose several other settings at this stage, including the image size, meta tags, or whether to add a watermark. 